Hey guys and welcome to my last video of 2017. Obviously it's my last video because today is the last day of 2017, but I thought a lot about what to make my last video of this year and after thinking back and forth about making it about the best music videos or like the best tours I attended, I thought I wanted to make it really really special and tell you about the stuff I got at shows this year that really mean a lot to me. I'm not talking about like t-shirts I bought or something, or more like a little more special thing like plaques and drumsticks I caught and something like that because in the end if you get something like that you really treasure it and I just wanted to show my stuff to you. Let's start off with something a little more special and I only got one piece of that. It's a part of Whale's Drums from Against the Current. Um, I did buy this and this is the only thing in this whole like set that I really officially bought but like when you're one of the first people at the venue they sometimes have these drum covers that you can actually buy and I have one from last year, I gotta be honest, but I wanted another one. This is a bit of another size and I still haven't gotten this up on my wall, which is really frustrating me. But I think they'll have a place, like a special place in my room very, very soon. And I really like this thing and I think it's so unique and it's signed and that's just really, really nice. Moving on to basically my favorite part, drumsticks, because I do really, really, really love if I get the chance to actually catch a drumstick because I don't know, I'm really a drummer's girl. I mostly have like crushes on drummers. I don't know why that's the case, but yeah, I caught three drumsticks. It looks like it's four, but this one is actually a broken one and I'll get to that like right now because this was from the support of Against the Current. They're called Hunger and they were really nice and they got a drummer and I talked to them and like he gave it to me and said that like it's played with extra love because I saw them three days before the show where I caught that and I was talking to them after the show and I was already telling them that I'll be coming back and the drummer like already recognized me before the show when we were waiting in line and he talked to me and then after the show he gave that to me which is really really nice and I'm really grateful for that. The next drumstick, and I really can't believe that this is actually a thing, is a drumstick by The Pretty Reckless and I caught this in August and it was so cool, like I didn't expect that and I was like freaking out after the show, I was so so happy about it and I still am and yeah, I, I still can't really believe and I love that this has a logo on it because a lot of people don't have logos on it. And last but not least, the third drumstick I caught this year and it's with like a plastic tape thing, something. It's really looking extra, like fancy, special. And it's by Swimmers. He only threw one, this one drumstick and I'm so especially grateful for that. I really just got into them this year and I was so happy that they got to play a show. I was there like an hour or an hour and a half before the show started but I still got front row because there were only like a couple of people there which made me so happy and yeah I think that's my favorite drumstick I caught this year and that's just so extra nice. I actually got two of these like lemonades from like a VIP upgrade I got from Against the Current because I had this upgrade for Vienna and for Munich but I'm still very grateful for that and I really like it and look at how pretty it is. I, I kind of paid for that so like I paid 35 euros for the whole meet and greet thing so in the VIP meet and greet there was this lemonade a poster which I'm gonna show you right now and like the photo opportunity talk to them for a bit which was really nice and I had it two times and I really enjoyed it. And let's let's move on to the poster, which is like super pretty in my opinion. Like I already got another poster from the meet and greet I had with them last year, but I think that this poster is even prettier. And I'm really happy I actually have it two times. Here you can see that it's actually signed and super cute. And I just, it's just sad that it's so small because I would really fancy it if it was a little bit bigger. But yeah, it's still really nice. Moving on to what is probably the biggest part I have. It's a pile of set lists I got from shows this year, which is really nice. And they're actually in no particular order, like I didn't like sort them out, but here we go. Borderline show. Wah. Here we go, Borderline show against the current August. The show I talk talked about probably the most this year and was really nice and I cut this from the stage and I got this after the show which was so so nice and I love it both and yeah 
Saint, the support, and against the current, the main act, and I got them both, and it's super rad, and I really, really love it. And two set lists by the main, and yeah. Um, it's probably an understatement to say that I'm happy about this because it was so especially important for me to get one of these because I just love the main so much and it was my first time ever seeing them live like on this tour and I was so happy that I actually got these like they mean so much to me and I think they're the most important set list I got this year. The most fucked up set list, that's the way it is. Like there's tape in the back as well, I'm sorry but from rumors that was an incredibly lucky show for me, like for real, but it was so cool. Um, I'm really sad that they actually like taped half of the name, but you can still see it and I still know what they played and that's really cool, so yeah, I'm really happy about that. I also talked about Bry before on my channel and yeah, I've seen them twice this year in November and in April and this set list is from April and I got it off of stage and then I let him sign it afterwards after the show and he was like oh you're so sneaky letting me sign my own set list but this is so cool I was so happy I actually got it it was the night before my birthday so this was kind of like an early birthday present which was really really rad and I really liked it so this is so cool and last but not least another against the current set list from my show in Munich in February which is also really, really cool and I really like it and I just really like going through it again so I can never forget what they actually played. Even if you can like look it up in the internet, it's not the same and I do plan on actually like um, getting a wall full of my set list, which would be really cool but I'm kind of like thinking I don't have the place for like space for that. But I really hope I'm gonna be able to figure something out really, really soon and Let's just stay tuned for that. If I'm able to put it all up, I'm gonna show you for sure. A uh, little something I got, which is like a drawing of an alien I got from Nico from the Technicolors is because we shared pizza and that was like so special, but it's a longer story, I guess. And it's been so, so sweet and I'm so happy that he got me this and it's like, it probably wasn't a big deal for him, but it is for me. And I'll just treasure that forever and that's just so nice. And coming to my last category, I actually have five, but I only got four here with me. I'm missing my all-time low one. I don't have it here right now. I still got it in my flat, but I also got an all-time low one, which maybe I'm gonna show you like another time. But first, let's start off with the only one I have that has not no logo on it. It's just like plain green with like a the person that made the plaque. You know what I mean? And it's from Nico from the Technicolors. The Guy which I just talked about which was really nice. I got one from the main but it's really just so fucked up and yeah that's really sad because I would have loved if it was like a proper logo but there was lovely little lonely written on there but when I got it it already looked like that which is kind of shitty but I was really happy that I actually got one of these. And moving on to another against the current piece. I got a lot of against the current this year. I've seen them three times so that's kind of no surprise and yeah it was really nice and I finally got a plaque after seeing them five times. I got one plaque so that's really nice and the last but not least pick I got is by Swimmers and I think this is by far the prettiest. I think the pink shade is just really really pretty and yeah I just love it and I think it's so cute. So guys, this was it. All the like greatest stuff I got at shows this year, which I'm really, really grateful for. Tell me what you got, what is really important to you in the comments below. And see you all in my next video next year. Bye!